Hello there and welcome to my rather short video on a very basic comparison between the three Masterwork snipers in Anthem so far, the Truth of Tarsis, the Wyvern Blitz and the Siege Breaker. All footage was captured in Grandmaster 1. Here's just a quick look of my gear showing that no reload mods are being used. Yes there's a few damage bonuses on the weapons themselves but I can't help that, that is what they rolled with. Again, here's a close-up on the stats that affected the weapons. So here we are first off with the Truth of Tarsis, I'll call it Truth from here on out. So the statement I wanted to prove was that Truth does the most damage of all Masterwork snipers without even dedicating a build to it. So I start by seeing how long it takes to empty all my shots of Truth, then I'd use that amount of time to see how many shots of the other weapons I could fit into that time frame. So if that sounded confusing, I'll be explaining it a little better later on. So the frames, the freeze frames that you can see after the weapon firing segments are just to show the timestamps between each weapon. I start from the first frame. Uh, I start the first frame from when the first bullet lands, and the second freeze frame is when the last shot lands. That is only for the truth. For the other weapons freeze frames, first frame will again be when the first shot lands but the second will be exactly 28.89 seconds later so that is how long it took to actually empty all nine shots of the truth if this still does sound confusing don't worry it's all summarized later in a horrible screen grab of a notepad So here's just the video and the freeze frame evidence of the damage values of all the snipers. I use the same enemy on the scars because they seem to have the same uh, critical damage hitbox and values. So again, nothing was changed between the switching of the guns, just the guns themselves. Uh, my javelin level stayed just about the same. So here we can see all the damage by all the different guns. So I set out to prove that Truth does the most damage of all Masterwork snipers without even dedicating a build to it. Now that's not entirely true, there are a few variables. You have to keep in mind that Truth's intrinsic perk detonates any primers on the enemy for that shot. So if you're in a team that's half decent and priming Tyrant Mind with one primer at a time, or priming, detonating, waiting for the dot to wear off before priming them again with the same primer, then Truth will put out more damage than what I've shown. Also Truth and Siege, uh, there are less bullets that you have to land for, between Truth and Siege. So I'll just sum this up for you. If you never miss and you have a good team and you mainly use the sniper just for bosses or chunky health legendaries, then use Truth. If you can track nicely and you can land full auto rapid shots consistently, Siege. Plus you'll be priming them every three shots and you can use it on multiple legendaries if they are in the area. If Bioware decides to create a scenario where ammo is super scarce then we'll be using Wyvern Blitz. Right now it's absolutely useless because of how quickly you can refill your ammo in like Tyrant Mind when the millions of spiders come out. Truth and Siege are the best boys in my humble opinion. Despite all the backlash that Anthem currently has, I love it. And I'm still having a blast playing it. Let's spread the positivity by being constructive and positive in the right way if you do decide to give any criticism. So thanks so much for watching and I hope this helped your decision making on where to spend your masterwork embers. See ya.